This show is sponsored by ExpressVPN. Stop putting your online data at risk and get protected at expressvpn.com slash let's play. You're watching Animal Crossing Cable. And now, back to Come and Nook on Our Door. The fun never ends when you're the bestest of friends. When life's got you down and the real world's a bore, you can come and nook on our door. Bow! Oh. oh, no. I've just been looking over my month's bills and it, it seems as if my daughter Barnabas has just spent so much of my money on her online shopping addiction. Knock, knock. I'm coming in. Oh, who could it be? Where are you? I'm coming. Just give me a hot second. Oh. <laughs> I, just, I had too much afternoon wine. <laughs> oh, Tr oh. Tr Trisha, can I talk to you about, I'm so distressed. Uh, my oh. daughter, Barnabas, just been spending all my money. Oh, no. I didn't want to say anything, but I have noticed your online packages have been piling up on your front door. Every day, it, it Amazon, Target, uh, J.C. Penny. I can't stop it. What do I do? I don't know what to tell you, but I will tell you something. My children, Navy, Taylor, and Haley, are perfect angels, and they would never do something like that to me. They would never. I know. I just. I don't know what to do. I. I don't know where I failed. I've. I feel like I'm such a cool mom. I bought this. Uh, beanie from H&M, and I don't wear shoes in the house, uh, so I just don't know where I went wrong. Oh, uh, I, I, you know, it, it's not you, it's society, but have you thought about boarding school? I suppose to afford boarding school when I can't, she's made, taking all my money. <laughs> well, uh. You Did I just hear that you're sending me to boarding school? <gasps> Barnabas! No. I, we, Mother! I can't get off this couch. <laughs> there we go. Did you have some afternoon wine, too? Barnabas, I... Listen, I just... I, I want... Oh, please don't! Please! I want you to stop spending all of our money. We have only have so many... Nook Miles, and I just hit the wrong reaction button, but I just, I need you to love me and not spend all of our money. Why would you do that? Why would I do that? What do you mean, why would I do that? Oh, why, why would I do that? Oh, I just want to be accepted by others, and everyone else is buying so many clothes, and I can't fit in. I'm so behind on all the trends. I don't know what to do. I mean, oh, you, you poor can't... thing. How could you let your child go without fashionable clothes? Well, it it seems like you two seem maybe to have the same style. Uh, what? Well, I I feel like Barnabas was wearing that outfit yesterday, Trisha. Uh, Barnabas just happens to have great style, and we that should. That's my that. outfit. What, Tr Trisha? Oh, I don't know what you're talking about. You must be mistaken. I left the tags on it. They're right there. I can return them at any point in time. I knew it. Listen, when you're going to leave your clothes out in front of the like front door, of course I'm going to check them out. Make sure people don't steal them. But you're the one stealing, Trisha. Uh, borrowing is not the same as stealing. Oh. You what? have to ask to borrow. <laughs> As your neighbor, I have lent you so much sugar and cream. How dare you treat me like this? The sugar was bad. What? It had ants in it. What did you tell you, that? Trisha? We wouldn't want to tell you, but now you're here stealing our thing. So what else are we going to do? Now we're all crying. If I sit on a couch, I would, but I can't, so I'm just going to continue. Whoa, hello. Baby, oh, what are baby, you doing? Wait. Baby, what do you, baby, come on. Goo, goo, gaga, goo, goo, gaga, H&M.
Goo oh, Gaga. Uh, you know what, everyone? Baby's right. Uh, but Barnabas, you and the baby do not need to have expensive clothing to be cool because you, you already are, Barnabas. And Trisha, you're a lowlife, but maybe cooler clothing will make you less so. So, um, thank you, baby, for being the voice of reason here. I I don't think I've learned anything today except what horrible neighbors you all are. Oops. Well, <laughs> <laughs> uh, well thanks for coming I, by, Trisha. Um... Uh, do you have any butter I can borrow to make uh, cinnamon rolls? <laughs> you can get this butter from my butt. Excuse me. <laughs> that uh, was cold. Well, come here, baby. Let me rock you to sleep. Goo goo gaga. Mary, I'll take your baby and go to oh. the couch. Come, come here, baby. Come, come to the couch with me. Um, I don't think both of us. I'll just, I'll just stand by the baby. I love this baby. Google I Google love you. baby. I love you too, mother. Yeah. Okay. All right. Now here's I'm still sending you to boarding school. What? Bye. Bye. The fun never ends when you're the bestest of friends. When life's got you down and the real world's a bore, you can come through on our door. We'll be back after a word from our sponsors. Okay, next is slide. You ain't very high. Oh, God, no, 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 really I'm going to save you from that Jimmy Buffett concert he's peddling. Don't worry about it. Here's what you need. Okay, caveman. Mm. You, humans together, strong. Strong. Society, yes. good. Yes, strong. Mm. Caveman with best technology mm. win many followers. Technolo. Oh. Is this social media? It's great. <laughs> Gather many followers. Yeah, I get Women it. types. Mm. Mm. The good ones. Like men who refined <laughs> no. know how to <laughs> make snoo snoo no club snooze. club mm. mm-hmm. go go tell, tell more, more when time for eat eat yes yes mm. <laughs> it's really the food all over yes. Yes. food yes yes oh no it's really got no, it no, 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 saw no, the no. first word and I have what no you idea. need <laughs> make women like most is belly shovels <laughs> no. good luck what I'm just gonna let <laughs> him handle it <laughs> belly shovel use take food put in mouth <laughs> fork <laughs> <laughs> Fork okay. in the belly shovel. Do you take food? <laughs> Put in mouth. <laughs> belly shovel. Where belly coming? <laughs> food go to belly. <laughs> He's behind on the medical me, sciences. He's me, understa- me caveman. But me understand what spoon is. We not spoon. We spoon. I see spoon before. I kill man with one. And now back. The bells and the frugal. Ah, what a wonderful day. My lovely house full of my amazing things and my wonderful partner. I think today we will have a wonderful picnic out. But first, I think I'll check my closet. Are you cheating on me? Excuse me? I... I don't know how to say this. But I think you're cheating on me. Are you accusing me of something? I literally just asked you if you were. So yes, I am accusing you. This seems absolutely ridiculous. I, I I found some letters, and I found them. They were delivered to me, saying that you are seeing somebody else. Can I see those letters? No. Because no. I don't have pockets. I'm going to go check your drawers. Don't. Go. <gasps> These letters are addressed to me. Well. Really? You are cheating on me. I would never. When Literally, I lost it's, my it's memory been... last year, I said I would be faithful, mostly because I don't remember anyone else. I accepted you as a person. <sighs> I can't. Oh, hold on. 
And who Hi. are you? Hello? Hi? Hi. Oh, hi. Hello. It's me, your lover. I've been listening this entire time. Whose lover? Are you my lover? What? Yes. I'm who sorry, but listen, we've been we've been carrying on for about a year now, and I, I just can't keep it inside anymore. I love you. And I want you to run away with me, please. Uh, oh, no. Wait, me, I'm confused. My memory, my amnesia, it's coming back. I don't remember anything. How could you forget our summers in Tuscany? Our, our winters in Seattle? They mean nothing to you? Tuscany? That was our marriage spot. Um, Tuscany? I'm so happy. I'm so well-traveled. I can't believe this. <laughs> this is ridiculous. This is the oh, ultimate betrayal. You. Oh, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> <laughs> this is you're the worst you can't even remember our anniversary or that we're married listen. I have amnesia how many times do I have to tell you listen I'm forgetting that you have amnesia because I don't want to see you anymore <sighs> that's okay you can come with me we can be happy now <gasps> you're the only one who seems to understand me um whatever your name is how could you forget? Amnesia! I have amnesia! Maybe I have it too, because I also forgot that you have amnesia. You and understand my pain, at least. Oh my gosh. You know, you forget your whole life, and everyone just makes it hard on you. Just Listen. Don't, don't forget that your, your cue is to, to decide who you're going to go with. Oh. Action! Oh, oh, I must decide who I'm going to go with. You, who I think I'm married to, are you, who we spent wonderful, lovely afternoons in Tuscany? It was months. We got married in Tuscany! <laughs> Listen, whoever I choose, the other person will always have Tuscany. And I choose... And I choose... Uh... Uh... Uh, do you, uh, should we flip a coin? Can we do How that? Dare you. Am I just a coin flip to you? Is that love what? is a chance and Q fortune? Q Q Muriel. Q and oh, there's a knock at the door. Oh my god! There's a knock at the door. Who are you? What? Which one is my <laughs> evil twin? I can't tell. Which one is it? Which one of you has amnesia? Wait, look at me, look at me, look at me. <gasps> We're identical. Oh She's my god, you what? just dyed your hair. I am the true lover of um Ambrosia. Ambrosia, it's me. My twin sister e who is evil is uh who is named also who is also named Amnesia. Uh set me off on a career of uh mariachidum and <gasps> I I thought it was I thought she would take care of you and and she told me she wouldn't lie and try to take take my life over my identity while I became a mariachi star but clearly she has lied. I don't remember any of this. She's like all so of us. confused. It's it's me. It's uh it's me. Yeah. Oh, you remember being do you it's remember our wedding in asking you? Of course I remember our wedding in Tuscany. Your <gasps> mother was there. My mother was there. Her mother was there. Was I there? Mother was there. You were there. You were my best man. <laughs> if I was there, why did she remember I was there? I uh, have amnesia. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, who here doesn't have amnesia? I don't. Let's cue the next segment. Oh. oh. <laughs> we'll be back after a word from our sponsors. Welcome. Thank you for joining oh, wow. us. Music brings us all together. It makes us feel happy when we're when we're down and it makes us feel down when we're too happy. We got to balance it out. Keep it even. What we've done is 15 just songs. If you want to check it out, below it's 15% off your first order, half the price of any other cassette. It's going to sound amazing in a very beautiful 
poetic way. It's riddled with feelings. They sound great. Celebrities like Snoop Dogg listen to those beautiful songs. Just go check it out. Love You Zipper is filmed in front of a live studio audience. Well, hello, children of the world. It's me, your favorite neighborhood, not a cult leader. And today I'm here to talk about my favorite subject, Zipper. Now, I know you guys are very familiar with Zipper. He is the one that we all love and appreciate, right? You know, Zipper makes me think of the alphabet. My favorite letter in the alphabet is Z, which stands for zipper. And my second favorite letter of the alphabet is O, which stands for overlord. Now, those two things are completely unrelated, but they do both bring a smile to my face. Now, why don't we sing a little song? We all know it. You've all heard it. Z is for zipper and O is for over. Oh my God, I forgot that we have a friendly neighbor, uh, coming to visit us today to talk about that one beautiful animal man who is absolutely not wearing a suit. Zipper. Hello, hello, hello. I'm just your friendly neighbor. I'm here to talk about the most lovely thing in the world. Zipper. You know what my favorite animal is, everyone? It's the bunny, bunny suit. Rabbit. Yes. Mm, the bunny suit is such a wonderful animal. Don't you all love the bunny suit? All praise the bunny suit, everyone. Praise, praise be the, the bunny, bunny suit. suit. Yay! So, have you praised the bunny suit today, children? Because I know I have. Ah, oh, look at this lovely, lovely room full of everything we know and love about Zipper, which is eggs. His Always belt. eggs. Hey, eggs. I, wonder, I wonder if there's anyone who doesn't like Zipper because we should find them and take them out. You know, I've never met a Zipper naysayer at any time in my life, and that's because he is the greatest did, overlord. Did someone say Zipper? <gasps> Why, yes. I've hated that bunny since 1942. Where is it? If only I could bring my axe in here, I'd hit him with it. And I'd destroy all these Easter eggs. Because I How hate that bunny. How dare you speak about Zipper like that on my set. I, I have half of mine to have your hide. Hightailed out of here with a vengeance. Vengeance! You can't stop me, and neither can you, uh, little lady, because I hate that bunny, and I'm gonna eat bunny for breakfast. Hey, and children. Lunch and dinner. Oh, children, you guys know what we do the blasphemers around here. 
There's only one. Th- there's only one way to handle them, and that's to silence them. Come, Sil- child, silence the non-believer. N- silence I them. I zipper. Please. How do I- Where the hell is zipper? Sweet, loving child who also loves zipper. Um, Why don't you tell everyone about how much you love zipper? Oh, hi, everyone. Zipper is my favorite, and I will murder for him. I mean, I will hug all my friends. Would you like to go out back for a hug? Huh? Hey, a cowboy? Talk- yeah. Talk- yes. Talk- yes, you cowboy. Take the take the cowboy blasphemer out back for a good what? long hug. Yeah, let's, let's a lovely hug. hug. A way. lovely let's hug. hug. Let's go this way. We're gonna hug so much. Is that yeah. bunny? Is that bunny out there? Oh uh, yes. Yes. Yes, everything. Are you really insane out there? You gotta talk about my bunny? Can, can we stop? Can we can we cut the child's microphone? Can we cut, cut the cut, cut the child's microphone? Cut the child's microphone! Well, that was lovely. Uh, Security took care of the issue at hand. The unspoken issue has now been taken care of, and it will not be spoken about again. And that's just how it goes in Zippa's neighborhood. Now, don't forget... Oh, hi. (laughs) Now, don't forget to uh, tune in next week when we figure out what exactly you can't do with the eggs that our mighty overlord leaves us. Goodbye. Let's sing this again. Z is for zipper. O is for overlord. Z is for zipper. O is for overlord. Yay! Give credit. Give credit. We'll be back after this commercial break. Hi, everybody. This just in. Grandpa woke up and this is what he's scooping. Super early in the morning. What do we do? Start with, it's a nuke cereal called Ready, Set, Crunch. Here's the breakdown. They are made with real honey. Real marshmallows. Some memories. And a little bit of blood in there, too. Did you know that? Yeah, that's, that's how they make it. I mean, in terms of healthiness, good for that there heart. But it's fact. All Let's right. Let's get into that. Yeah. I detect goodness. Yeah. <laughs> Not bad. Dang! Oh! Oh! oh, oh. Experience that pungent taste with Ready, Set, Crunch. Also, check this out. This is taste you can see. Look how pretty it is! Wow! Look how fun! Three new unicorns in it! Oh, this is the selling point. It absorbs in the outer layer quite quickly, a little softness. But it maintains a crunch all the way through without scraping you up. You're right! I would sit- if that cereal was a couch, I'd flop down. No need to wait for it. Great taste. Get ready, set, crunch. That's the taste that you can eat. Come breakfast to lunch. Ready, set, crunch. The taste that you can eat. And now, back to Slider, she wrote. We are here today to mourn the loss of K.K. Slider. (laughs) The loving dog musician who brought love into our lives. Oh, my sweet. (laughs) Does anybody want to say any words before we move outside? I I would. um, So, my sweet K.K., he was... You know, a dog, but I loved him. And, uh, <laughs> oh, this is so hard. Oh, I just, <laughs> when he said he wanted a prenup, I I didn't understand why. And I feel like, I feel like he was pressured into it. And now his sweet, his sweet widow is left without nothing. But that's not what's important here. What's important is he's gone. <laughs> And I have no money. <laughs> you don't need money. I mean, I don't have my honey. I don't have my honey. Sorry, that came out wrong. Oh, <laughs> right, right, right. So how did you know 
KK, lovely groundskeeper slash oh. maid slash cook slash butler slash. You you can just call me Tony. Okay, Tony. Uh, well, KK and I, you know, we've been good friends for seventy four years now, and I've been working with him on this um, KK ranch for you know for a really long time. So I know a lot of stuff. I know a lot of what goes on here, and I know a lot of people's intentions, so that's all I'm going to say. That's all I'm going to say. Well, Tony is a dear family friend. Hmm. Dear dear family friend. Who who will will definitely keep me company at night, right? Tony? Tony? uh, Tony? Well, as you both know, (laughs) I know the deceased because we went to college together was a lovely roommate. We had many a charming night together. We held each other some nights, but alas, it was not to be. Mm. But now that he's gone, would you like to get to know each other better? <laughs> well, I a person would just... with a fortune. I mean, a fortunate personality. Well, 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 <gasps> what do we have here? Who is Who are you? I am just a very lowly detective who has taken an interest in this specific death. Now, each and every one of you knew the deceased, correct? Yes, that's why we're at his funeral. Mm. Yeah, of course. It's uh, no uh, best, bestest friends. Best, best, best friends. A widow, a friend. A handyman. Each one with his own vendetta against the deceased. How oh, dare you? Vendetta? I don't Mr. Detective, so much. Mr. Uh, Detective, if I could, please. As someone who has worked on this this house and, and a good friend of Mr. KK's for the past mm-hmm. 75 years or 74, whatever I said earlier, mm-hmm. I would just like to say that these... Lovely women here have their fair share of secrets, Mr. Detective. The widow, perhaps. Was it, was she in it for the money? Was she in it for the fame? For the clothes? For the music? And the best friend? Mm, No. What did you say? Oh, uh, we went to culinary school. Mm, He never attended a four-year university, as you so claim. We, we, I, I held his toe beans in my hand and they were so warm until they weren't. And it was lovely. Interesting. You keep your hands off his toe beans. Those were my toe beans. They were technically my toe beans first. Now, hold on, hold on, hold on. Every one of you has a motive. Each and every one of you is a suspect, but I know who the killer is. But first, I will interview you all openly for exposition. Oh, no. Now, I mean, oh, yes. First, the best friend. Now, of course, no one would suspect you. I mean, you're oddly charming, even though you seem to have a lot going against you. Now, you said you helped each other. Did you have an affair with the deceased? (gasps) Well, uh, affairs... I mean, yes, but it wasn't technically an affair. It wasn't technically an affair. Then what would you- The prenuptial agreement between this lovely, wonderful woman over here in the green dress. Yes, hello, how are you? Uh, We can can go out, we can go out uh, later if you'd like. I'll treat you to dinner. I will treat you right. Yeah, but I'm angry right now. Yes, but you won't be angry on a full stomach. I am a little hungry. You know, we'll, get you is- a, we'll get you a little doggy bag. I mean, <gasps> to go bag. This is a highly suspicious conversation and so inappropriate for a wake, but I'm still so very charmed by you, sir. I don't think it was you. Oh, now, thank you. Tony, on the other hand, you say yes. that you and the deceased were friends. Yes. Would a friend make another friend be his butler, maid, cook, and groundskeeper? Well... Listen, it's what I was born to do. I come from a long line of cooks and maids and butlers and groundskeepers, and it's it's just what my family does. And Mr. KK understood that. Hmm. 
be that as it may, did you not hold at least a bit of resentment for the deceased? Not at all. KK gave me everything. The reason I... He... Well, I was going to wait to say this, but he left me everything in the will. What? I knew it. What? Which leads us to the widow. The sad, grieving, penniless widow. When I walked in, I knew that you were a five-pound bag of trouble in a one-pound sack. <laughs> oh, dare you. That's the wrong emotion. Ah, oh, there we go. Listen. I am so upset right now. Everyone knew about your prenuptial agreements with the deceased. We all knew that if anything were to happen to him, you would be the one left high and dry on the street. So exactly. what did you Exactly. So what did you have to lose, ma'am? If you were going to have nothing, then you would lose nothing. My sweet honey bun gave me everything I wanted. I gained nothing from losing him. So for you to accuse me, accuse me. You look how adorable I am. You think I'm going to get these hands bloodied? No. no. Yes. Listen. Also, he's your honey? Mm, he's my sugar bone. Oh, how dare you? How dare you? The end of the day, though, he married me. Yes, and he but, you all. know, sometimes you just have to bury your sugar bone. I mean, savor, savor, savor your sugar bone. Now listen, whether he be honey or sugar bone, there's one thing that we can all agree on. That the day KK died, the music stopped. But, what if I were to tell you, he wasn't dead. What? What? Yes, I know I... that, listen, I know that we all associate KK with the music in our lives, but and when that music stops, we can only assume that he has died. But, in actuality, someone just turned the music off. Oh. Yeah, my bad. I, I tripped over the chord, guys. Let me plug yeah. it back in. Hang on, I'm sorry. Uh, can we cue the music? Oh. Yes, that's true, my friends. KK is alive! I <laughs> oh, good. I guess I don't get to steal money. Nah. Hun. Nothing. I'm Music, please! Really hard. <laughs> and yeah. you're not invited anymore here. <laughs> Yes, so, in conclusion, uh, Ms. Widow, you are no longer a widow, and you are very well-to-do once again. Uh, charming, yet somehow off-putting best friend. Yes. You've had your memories, and Tony, it's back to groundskeeping, I'm sorry. Uh, it's okay. No, uh, you excuse I, me, I, I, everyone. I'm, I'm gonna go take a bath. <laughs> uh, somehow I feel like I got the short end of the stick. Guess hey. I'll go play fetch. No one can take the memories from you. Remember that. I suppose that's true. Would you like to go make some memories together? Absolutely. Let's go. Fantastic. This has been Animal Crossing Cable. Amazing. Well, the Tobin line. I held his Tobin. Oh, Tobin. Died. <laughs> what? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Coming in. Yeah, we're doing like a cast Q&A director commentary. <laughs> I love that. Yeah, that's great. Kayla, what a great way to uh, wrap it up, too. Like, Thank yeah, you. Get right here. <laughs> so I was thinking about that. I'm like, well, it's not like the end of the segment. It's the end of the whole thing. But that's good. Yeah. Get everyone out of the house. Take us out. Nailed it. <clears throat> Thanks. If, if I'm good at anything, it's shutting down the party. <laughs> <laughs> when it's supposed to be shut down. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Of course, of course, good. of course. Guys, it's it's 11 o'clock. Uh, we have a meeting tomorrow at 9 o'clock. Let's just wrap this up a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Come on, knock yeah, on my door. Again. Hello, chat. Uh, this, thank you for watching uh, Animal Crossing Cable, everyone. <laughs> Uh, and, and shout out to our lovely cast and crew. You're taking a look, giving some love, chat. Uh, if anyone has questions about the broadcast, we're here to answer them. Uh, there's going to be a bit of a delay, so 
That'll be a little one, but I guess to start off then, uh, how'd you guys feel experiences wise? <laughs> uh, I know what, what can be said right now. <laughs> that was... uh, introduce ourselves very quick while we're at it. Yeah, please. Uh, uh, director, you start? start. Oh, sure. Um, hi, I'm Lindsay. I am the director and uh, currently the voice of God. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Praise be. Uh, there are two camera people. Oh, hi, I'm Matt. <laughs> hey, I'm yeah. Jaren. Hey, lovely camera ops. Nice. We're rocking it. Uh, I'm Steffi. Hello. Uh, I'm, I'm, next. <laughs> I'm Kayla. Thank you. My first time as a baby. <laughs> Nailed it. Nailed it. Uh, and I'm over here. I'm Mariel. Um, and can I just say that baby fucking nailed it. Goo Goo Gaga H and M is the best line. Fantastic. Ever written. Thank you. Oh. Thank you. I'm Caden. Uh, you. Uh, I've been here before. Also, I'm a sheepdog. So you're a sheepdog. <laughs> Perfect. I love it. I love the sheepdog. Um, starting off, people said, "What was the like inspiration for this uh, daytime television?" Uh, I just want to do <laughs> sitcoms, and I like that you can make a show inside of Animal Crossing. I didn't want to do another game show. Maybe later. And I broke it down to some segments, and the lovely cast helped out. I'm not as familiar with soap operas, so that was all like stuff. And pretty much everyone else in cast knows more about soap operas. Than me, so. <laughs> Who cut commercials? I will say real quick. That was uh, Jacob and Jaren. Uh, Jaren, shout out, sir. Since you're physically here, do you want to talk yes. about part of that process? Or uh, yeah, it was. Uh, so we we split them up. Uh, Jacob did the commercials and like the cable intro type thing, and I did the uh, all the show intros. So it was like a you know just kind of going back and forth with Lindsay and trying to make everything work out i'm super glad the uh zipper one got the reaction it did. <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny. But as soon as like the like inverted like demonic cult thing showed up in the in the intro like this the chat went crazy for it it was awesome it was so good <laughs> I, one of Lindsay's notes was like we need more we love you zipper and please use the whisper one <laughs> <laughs> i was like iris can you whisper this i'm like oh it's great perfect she nailed it yeah. yeah. I also like that we had like three separate meetings where I was like, hey, so before I explain this segment, um, there's going to be some cult stuff. Are you cool with that? <laughs> All right. <laughs> Everyone was super down. <laughs> there was also one that I saw earlier on uh, who was asking whose island we were on. Oh, this is, uh, that's Lindsay's mine. Island. Yeah, Lonely yeah. Island. <laughs> uh, how long did this take to set up uh i guess like a week planning wise is when i started and i had a big meeting um but i didn't like focus on just this obviously the biggest part and the hardest part of like setting up was just changing sets which took way longer than expected which i figured would happen but that's why you saw like six of the same commercial so sorry everyone yes, sorry, yes. <laughs> live television woo <laughs> that ended up being very fitting though to like actual television oh yeah for <laughs> sure yeah that's perfect and um also shout out to sean um one of our age animators who made belly shovels which you saw a good number of times and then pigeon <laughs> studios who did all the uh remixes and the other commercials that you've seen so check out their work thank you if you bought a belly shovel <laughs> shout really out. Bad, <laughs> we're struggling <laughs> Will this become a longer standing thing? I'd love to do this again. How do y'all feel? This oh, is yeah. This is a blast. Okay. Well, uh, that being said, I can ask you guys, what other genres should we go into? I'm losing my voice. <laughs> uh, science fiction, for sure. Oh, I'm glad oh, I'm yeah. I thought about that already. Ah, oh, yes. I think a uh, teen drama, like an OC type of thing would be fun. Ooh, oh, my CW. God. CW. <laughs> I've always wanted to be a heartthrob. Kayla, <laughs> <laughs> like you're already a heartthrob. <laughs> I would like, love to a do a reality problem, like, show. Oh yeah, reality show would be good too. Oh my god, that'd be great. Could like a do who's Love line? Island. What do who's, who's line? line? Yeah, who's line? Just put like three <laughs> chairs in the back and then have like two carry off to the left. And <laughs> that would be that amazing. Yeah, do a bunch of yeah, improv. Have Laura Bailey on piano over there. <laughs> Can we um, do a bunch of like pitfalls and just recreate an episode in entirety of the MTV's challenge? I don't yes. know if I've seen that. Oh my gosh, yes. Oh my <laughs> so basically, it's like everybody from across like all of the MTV reality shows, and then they make them do like like survivor style challenges is crazy that's awesome yes oh seeing anime in the chat seeing a lot of anime oh, in the chat I didn't think of that. 
Yeah. How do, you, oh. how do you do that with a studio setup, though? Man, that's hard. Like, uh, you could do a uh, classroom. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Yeah. That's true. Turn Ninety percent of anime yeah. take pl- <laughs> I mean, takes place this, in the classroom. This stuff like, also, also true. exists. Like that could be a transformation sequence right there. There you go. <laughs> it's true. That's a good it's call, true. Matt. Matt I mean, is even, magical girl. They even gave us like, I mean, look. Yeah, that's like, that's boom. Boom. Look at that. Yeah. Yeah. Nope, no, you're right. Yeah. yeah, there are Sailor Moon outfits in here too. Yeah, that's true. Wasn't there an anime about like? Chef people or something. Yeah, it's uh, food, food wars. wars. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Yeah. Food wars. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, let's just do food wars. <laughs> <laughs> Jaren's like, yeah, sure, why not? <laughs> Nothing wrong with that. <laughs> uh, I will say, I saw a question. It says, uh, "Can someone have Kayla explain what she does at RT and how did she become so cool?" Oh dang. Uh, well, let's see. So, like, you know how we showed those fake ads? Uh, <laughs> three <laughs> goodness. interstitials. Uh, my job is getting real ones into content, so I am sorry. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry I help. I'm on, yeah, I'm on the sales team. Uh, I do a lot of uh, activations. So, like, if you've ever been to RTX and you see, like, a branded booth there, uh, that was something I worked on. So, like, last year we had, like, the Stuber activation or, like, the full sale stuff. Uh, I help execute that kind of stuff. And then I also assist on, like, the podcast ad read side. Uh, and that's what I do. As for the cool part, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Comes naturally. Yeah. <laughs> just naturally, just suave and awesome. It is effortless. <laughs> uh, if I can ask, just from being in this uh, as an actor, what were some of your favorite moments, either from yourself or other performers? Kayla as the the baby. Yeah. <laughs> Kayla as as absolutely the 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 uh, the showrunner for We Love You Zipper that broke me so bad. It was so hard not to laugh. Um, I I want everyone to know that after we cut, I just went to everyone and I was like, "Hey, did I go too dark? I'm sorry." <laughs> no, no, it was Mariel, like... It was amazing. Uh. Mariel, I I didn't know what I was going to do, and then Lindsay did some sound effects, and it was just so funny. It was beautiful. Moment. I really um, wanted to. I didn't realize that I couldn't, because I, like, right before we went live with that, I was like, Lindsay, make me a best friend so I can walk in with my axe. And then I walked in, and yeah. the axe just went away, and I was like... <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Oh, I forgot you can't chop inside the house. I was like, oh, yeah, break stuff, and then it was worthless. <laughs> Oh well. Love, also, um, great. totally my bad on timing everything incorrectly. I knew it would happen, but we we're like, hey, live television. We got everything queued up. Micah will queue for the start of the show. We're good. And then I'm looking in the preview window and I see the guys doing Awu, but it's supposed to be the stream for the broadcast. I'm like, okay, maybe it went <laughs> yeah. over. They're definitely done talking about Awu. They're clearly like shooting the shit. So I should be seeing our stream. Maybe we didn't start cut like cut. Hang on. And I was like, hang on, Mariel. So I fucked it up. Like I messed up the intro, <laughs> but it was so perfect. I was like, "Oh, never mind. Okay, uh, go." So my, thank you for working with that. My names went from. Uh, I, at first, I was like, "Oh, Barnaby," and then I was like, "That name is so bad." And I was like, "Okay, a Barnabas." <laughs> Barnabas. <laughs> Where did that come from, Ariel? <laughs> Barnabas <know>. and <laughs> Barnaby. I don't know. Yeah. Do you know Barnabas? I or... do not know. Well, you should. <laughs> No, um, also, I, I saw I saw Trudel Strudels on the chat. Zoe, I love you so much. I miss you with my whole heart. <laughs> and also, shout out to all the, the Trudel squad that's in the chat. I see you guys. <laughs> oh, I was gonna say, Zomo Sis said, "Were the script were were their scripts or just improv?" No, uh, just like beats and improv. Yeah. <laughs> If that was scripted, we'd have to fire someone. I think. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It'd be me. Yes. <laughs> Get out of here. Well, it's also like one. I didn't. Want, the nature of this is so silly. I didn't want to like lock it in and be like, seriously, guys. There's a script. Learn your lines. <laughs> um, and two, like you know, it's the whole fun of it, and that allows you guys to play around with your acting prowess and do what Kayla. you do. <laughs> and like, I I don't think I could have given you anything better than something like Kayla leading "We Love You" zipper if I had scripted it. So, <laughs> why would I try and interrupt that kind of art? <laughs> Perfect. Man, that thing really put me in a Far Cry Five mood, though. I just want to like oh, go boy. fight cultists now. Ooh, that that I now understand where you pulled your reference from. <laughs> That's good. You nailed it. You nailed yeah, a real Jacoby in there. I liked everyone's characterizations. It was pretty great to watch everyone kind of like bring out 
their own version of it because obviously when you're putting things together i had an idea of what i would like it to be or just what i would do but that's kind of what i gave direction to these guys with as i said you know make it your own do your thing i didn't expect mariel to roll up as a cowboy <laughs> or we love you zipper but she did hey. and it was perfect did this go any way anywhere near what you expected it to Lindsay? <laughs> it went better i was saying earlier and i don't know if jaron heard me um when we were doing our pre pre-stream planning for a few hours uh they delivered the packaging and i was like god these are so good as always i'm like man i gotta make sure that like <clears throat> the, the the content itself is as good like the concept that i've created for this content this this content matches the level of like expertise you've given me here with this so i hope we've done justice and made it all seamless and awesome but i think we, i think it's great every i feel like anytime we do anything in animal crossing the people who are involved make it way cooler than i ever could have planned it to be so thank y'all very much. Yes, Stan Kayla. Agreed. <laughs> Stan baby. Stan Kayla. Stan, we Stan baby in this chat. Goo Gaga H&M. Gaga H&M. H&M, yeah, that was so good. <laughs> what a great end to the first segment. <laughs> so, like, it set everything up for everything else so well. That worked perfectly. And I'm also glad, too, like, I thought originally I would do an entire hour of a sitcom, but I think that would just would have dragged a lot. And this allowed us to play around with different genres too and different characterizations. But I guess sitcoms um, specifically, do y'all have any favorites? Because I wanted to do a Golden Girls parody originally. Oh, oh, I would do anything for a Golden Girls parody. I love the Golden Girls. <laughs> Same. I would love that. Legit. Legit. Um, I love like one day at a time is great right now. Currently, uh, like very much, n very nostalgic. Like three camera setup sitcom. Yeah. Um, gosh, what else? Parks and Rec. <laughs> oh <laughs> yeah. Say, it's, it's not three camera, but The Office. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. I finally yeah. watched that. I, after never seeing it before, I finally watched The Office. It was all right. <laughs> all right. Well. It was incredible. <laughs> yeah, it was all right. It was all right. It was all right. It was all right. All right. All right. It was for Overlord. When do we get? When do we get that shirt in the RT store? Oh, yeah. for Zipper. Oh, it was for Overlord. Oh boy, yeah. I'm all about it. And see now though, I do want like a. a, a Animal Crossing cable shirt would be good with the little bell. Oh, yeah. oh yeah. Jacob worked on. That's pretty good. Or just the show titles. I'm cool with a bells in the fruitiful shirt. Or um, come and come and so knock on our door shirt. The bells yeah. in the fruitiful. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. <laughs> they're, my titles are very cheesy. It. Thank you. No, they're perfect. <laughs> I like the uh, slider she wrote. Just was so. <laughs> That one Why? was hard. I was playing around with that for a while and I was like, murder. I was going to have it maybe take place in the museum, but traveling in this was insane. I mean, you guys saw what happened with the set changes. We had to run like six commercials. Just, uh, like, real, just like real TV. Yeah. Yeah. So I was like, okay, no, we're staying right the hell here. No one's moving. But when I planned it for it to be in the museum, I was going to call it murder at the Owlient Express. Cause, oh my God. Yeah, I know. It's really bad. And I came up with KK, KK she wrote. And I was like, that's way better. Come and nook on our door. I, I love it so much. Come and nook on our door. <laughs> I love, I don't know if you guys got to hear it too, because I don't think it broadcast, but did you hear the song or no? No. 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 You gotta hear them all. So literally the intro is just Jack going like, and now time for come and nook on our door. And I took music just from Audio Network. It's just a nice little like jazz, light, soft jazz song. Like, ba -do -ba -do -ba. <laughs> like, yeah that sounds sick call me so i sat in my room and i just like made up words and i was like what i do um uh the fun never ends when you're the bestest of friends when life's got you down and the world's in a you can come and nook on our door <laughs> so, <okay. laughs> mad dumb but yeah it was really fun i love stuff like that that being said, I don't know how y'all would feel about like a concert in Animal Crossing because I've talked about that before oh my God. too. Oh yeah, because that's that a big thing now. The in-game concerts. Since oh yeah, home. last night my uh, nephew um, was with us. Then he goes, "What time is it?" And I was like, "Oh, I don't know." And he was like, "Oh, I just missed the Diplo concert on Fortnite." And I was like, "What the fuck did you do?" <laughs> yeah, that's a big thing now, apparently. But again, like, like I don't you're know. eight, go away. <laughs> <laughs> yeah i'm chewing gum at your age oh my god kayla that's amazing 
Yes. Someone oh in chat God. said it. <laughs> KK knives cake knives out. Oh my god. Oh, that's so good. <laughs> oh, I'm so jealous. Why didn't I think of that? That's so good. LinkedIn, I think. Oh, oh. that's amazing. <laughs> Knives out. All right, we gotta do this again just so we can do cake knives out. <laughs> cake knives out. Knives out. Someone said all words are made up. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I'm now. <laughs> it's true. Those oh, commercials eight. were amazing. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, they were. They were all rocking. Someone has said to like a, a another musical, like a live H musical performance oh, like, in God. Animal Crossing. In Animal Crossing. <laughs> That's a lot. We could do it maybe. But I would I would pay any money to see Matt in Animal Crossing recreate that music video because that was a <laughs> <laughs> that was so good. Well, Matt's would be the easiest. We yeah, could do I that. Say, I know, yeah, but like having Matt do it like completely dark room. Oh, Matt yeah. sitting alone <laughs> in a chair in Animal right. Crossing, <laughs> slow panning camera. I yeah. am rejected. It's but, uh, <laughs> nah, I took so many pictures from that shoot that. <laughs> It just like every time I'm looking for another photo, I just have like a block of just dark photos and it makes me laugh so much. Thanks for letting me do your makeup that day, Matt. Oh yeah. That was a weird day. <laughs> I was like, I tried to do it and then Kaden had to come in and save me. <laughs> Steffi's like, how do I do makeup? It's like Steffi. <laughs> come on. I'm frozen. I think my internet's going out. Oh, that's oh, fine. No. Everyone, let's play a little bit over Dead Yamcha in honor of Mariel. Please join me. <laughs> Please come over to Dead Yamcha. Yes. Uh, yep. Play us out, Dead Yamcha. Matt, Jaren, Kayla, Caden, and Mariel's ghost. And the ghost of Yamcha. Steffi, thank you for joining us, too. Thank you for coming in. I love your net. I just saw it was pink. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, everyone. Smack that booty a little bit. Oh, Mariel's back. Yes. Nice, as you should. <laughs> Everyone, thank you for watching Animal Crossing Cable. This has been our first, but hopefully not last, broadcast. It will be tighter and cleaner, but that's the beauty of live television. It's messy and we love it. Thanks, y'all. Bye now. I've been looking over this month's bill and it looks like my daughter B Barnaby has... Hold on, Mary, Mary, hold, hold. <laughs> we haven't started yet. Okay. Oh. You're good, you're good. He said action. <laughs> he did, he did. <laughs> it's cool. Tech action. It was good. It was a fantastic performance. It was so good. Okay, Lindsay, you just cue me because I'm just going to sit here and cry. <laughs>